Hello everyone, today in this video we will be discussing about the module 5's most important question which is regarding the web mining and the web structure, web content mining, okay. So let's have a look at what is the important key concept in that. Before that, make sure the like button subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. It's a 12 mark question but it's very very easy question. So what do you exactly have to write is what is web mining, what is web content mining, what is web usage mining. What are the key points you need to write so that you can get all the whole 12 marks. Let's have a look at that. So uh, firstly you need to know this uh, structure which is regarding what is web mining. Mining, okay web mining means you'll be having the uh, web all the things in the web water is there the browser web pages tabs and the icons and everything you'll be having in the web right mining means what you are gathering the important information from that that is called as mining that uh, whole process is called web mining and it's divided into three parts the first part is the web content mining second is the web structure mining third is the web usage mining okay in web content mining you will be having the main contents of the web like the paragraph types and the text types image as images are there links are there and after that you have some um, documents or the pdf files after that you have some audio or some video is going to be uh, played there or some gif is going to be played powerpoint presentation everything whatever that consists of those elements right that is called as web content okay so you just have to remember these concepts here text image audio video and list or table of record so these things consist of web content mining the uh, finding out what is the patterns and the trends in these concepts is called as web content mining so I have to just write that for the uh, whole four marks then coming to web structure mining since it's not asked I will not be discussing in depth but it might be asked as well uh, equally important as uh, this one also so let's have a look at that in that you will be having hyperlinks and the document structure hyperlinks can be intra document or inter document intra document means inside the same document you will be going on going on and when you click a link you will be going to the same page in the same document inter document means between the different documents if you click a link here that will lead you to another document that is called as inter document and the document structure how it is like for example links are first or the hyperlinks are first and after that you have image what kind of structure you have made for html what are the design used that is called as structure mining if there is similar structure there is a high possibility that the content will also be similar so that is why we do the web structure mining finally we have the web usage mining which is the most important one why because in web usage mining you'll be getting to know what is the pattern of which user the user is more uh, attended to which of the part of the web what is the user spend more time upon every click is recorded in the client side as well as in the server side for by using this they will be gathering some patterns and the discoveries uh, will be done and the analysis will be done on the patterns so that next time when the user uh, visits the website the user will be getting to know exactly what uh, is to be searched in the web okay so this is all what you have to write in these three things make sure the like button subscribe to my channel for more videos like this thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next time